school. Don't you just... What are you doing? I need to put my game face on. Hutch Anderson broke up with his girlfriend. <gasps> what was that? Relax, it was just a piece of wood. Or a cat. Or maybe a sleeping hobo. <laughs> oh, oh, we are gonna die. You, you cannot steer and put on mascara at the same time. Fine, you take the wheel. What? I'm not old enough to drive. <laughs> Give me that makeup bag. This hutch better be worth it. Go like this. What are you doing? Blending. You know, you should really buy a warmer base if you want to make your eyes pop. Here we are. Wait, why, why are we in a forest? I'm not going to show up at school with my kid brother. Is that a coyote? Sure is. <laughs> Bozo. <laughs> it's the last time I wear musk deodorant. <laughs> yeah. no. Ow! Stiffer in the eye! Stiffer in the eye! Derby? Adam Young? Long time no see, man. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, slap put me in here. Slab? Who's Slab? Imagine if Godzilla and Bigfoot had a baby. I didn't even know they were dating. Hey, Hutch. Oh, uh, hi. I just thought you'd want to know I'm free Saturday. Really? You're not booked for a birthday party? A party? Sure, I'd love to go with you. Will you pick me up? Why? Is your tiny car in the shop? <laughs> wow. That clown is hot. That clown is my sister. I'm just saying, she brings out the animal in me. The balloon animal, but still. Meow. So what's the deal, Mr. Genius? We were like nine when you left school. I heard you became a university student. I did. Well, I guess that didn't pan out, huh? Because here you are in high school, just like me. You're even in my class. Actually, you're in my class. <laughs>my name is mr young welcome to grade nine science a kite a string and a key can anyone tell me who conducted this famous experiment you're a kid okay good empirical observation now back to benjamin frank how old are you not really relevant to the lesson mr slabinski Oh, you must be Slab. You know, you're right. I totally see Bigfoot, especially around the unibrow. <laughs> I'll be 15 in March. You're kidding me. You're only... 14. 14? <laughs> hey, 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 he's a genius, all right? Like Albert Frankenstein. <laughs> Albert Einstein. Whatever. The dude who made a monster out of dead body parts. Can you do that? Let's well, really just listen to my nana know. lost a foot in a vacuum cleaner accident. And she keeps it under the sink. I mean, it's all wrinkled and cankly. But we are making a monster here. <laughs> We're not making a monster! Okay, look, it's not that big a deal. I skipped a grade or two. Or 12. <laughs>
and graduated in the spring with a double major in astrophysics and molecular biomechanics. Science. Oh. What kind of genius becomes a high school teacher? I had other opportunities, but I wanted a job where I could get kids excited about science. <laughs> See, we're learning already. Velocity, adhesion, mold growth. Hey, Derby. Bigfoot? <laughs> I'm in Bigfoot in a flattering way. He does detect the force and the intrusion of man. <laughs> Students, please. That's enough. I want everyone back in their seats by the time I count to ten. One, two, three. Okay. That's more like it. Now, back to electricity. <laughs> oh. Oops. Hi, Principal Tater. Hey, you look like Harry Potter. <laughs> or, or not so Harry Potter. I told the school board it was a mistake to hire a child as a teacher, and as is usual, would you stop that? <laughs> I will not let you turn this school into a circus. I'm not going to turn this school into a circus. You did this! <laughs> OK, that was bad timing. <laughs> Everything's fine. Mr. Tater just wanted to know what kind of hors d'oeuvres I want for my welcome aboard party. <laughs> I know I'm late, but I was on the bus when a flock of bats swooped down and... Oh, great. The teacher's not in here yet. He's right there. Where? Behind that kid? It is the kid. Oh. Sorry I'm late, Mr. Young. I'm Echo. Echo, Echo, Echo. Is there an Echo in here? Or is it just... You. <laughs> Are you sure he's the teacher? Yes. We're just learning how to make a monster. <laughs> We're not making a monster! We're learning about... Very funny. Who took all the chalk? <laughs> Who has heard of the War of 1812? Uh, excuse me, uh, Mrs. Byrne, right? Oh, no. I was wondering if I could borrow some... You're late. Chalk. You're late, Chuck. <laughs> Take your seat. No, you don't understand. Uh, I'm a teacher. Sure you are. Do you think I was born yesterday? I can't imagine anyone thinks that. <laughs> Take your seat. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> the War of 1812. What are you doing here? Apparently learning about the War of 1812 from someone who lived through it. Oops. Pass that to you-know-who. No problem. <laughs> what up, boo? <clears throat> what is it, Chuck? Can I go to the bathroom? No. Come on, don't you ever have to tinkle? Every nine minutes. But I don't leave class to do it. I wear an absorbent undergarment. Want to see? No! Narrate! <laughs> Narrate! Mussolini found us! Actually, Mrs. Byrne, that was just the car. Duck and cover! Duck and cover! Well, I'm good for another nine minutes. <laughs> My key! My sandwich! Burn. Burn. Yeah, I get it. You burn me. I thought you were my friend. Ah! Ow! Oh, Mrs. Burn. Ow, ow, ow! This little chipmunk says he works here. 
Isn't there a minimum age to be a teacher? Well, there's certainly no maximum. <laughs> Mrs. Byrne, will you please go back to your class? Uh... That's a supply closet. Why are all the lights out in my classroom? Shouldn't you be getting back to class, too? Right. Oh, could I get a spare key, though? You don't have your key? Well, actually, I... Because teachers get a master key that opens every door in the school. If you've lost that key, you're going to be the youngest teacher ever to be fired from this school. Lost it? Pff, I'm just using it to uh, re replicate Ben Franklin's kite experiment. Fine. The janitor will let you in. I'll just call Dang. You called? Ah! How'd you get here? On fishing boat, hiding in horror the carcass of Manatee. <laughs> I appreciate this. Dang, was it? Yes, Dang, from Da Nang. <laughs> so, uh, they let you be teacher? Ouch, sorry. They made you a janitor while well, back in Vietnam you were probably a doctor or a computer programmer or something. No, I was janitor <laughs> at Dong Museum. <laughs> this is big step up. <laughs> anyway, next time you get locked out, easy to get in. I show you. <laughs> Dang! Yes? That was a maid. Zing. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, class. Prank the new guy, but I'm gonna need that key. That. Great. Everyone ditched. Oh. Echo, you came back. And I could tell you weren't like the others. I knew you were different. I knew you were special. Yeah, I just forgot my backpack. <laughs> you! No running in the hallway. You! Pants on, mister. <laughs> It's Mr. Potato Head. <laughs> and so, class, Benjamin Franklin was the first to label electrical charges as what? Uh, echo? Positive and negative? You're positively right. <laughs> Very good. OK, now, Franklin's experiment led us to coin many words we use today. Battery, conductor, discharge. Can anyone tell me what discharge is? Oh, Echo, you always answer. Let's give someone else a chance. <laughs> How about you, Slap? What are you doing? I'm waiting, Mr. Slabinski. <laughs> Duh! Discharge is the gooey stuff that come out of my nose. I like to spread it on toast and eat it. <laughs> I said pants on! <laughs> Awesome. You were awesome. I love the way. <laughs> okay. Class dismissed. <laughs> hey, thanks for ditching my class. I left in the name of science. I went home to get Nana's foot. <laughs> I mean, we need if we're gonna make our monster. We're not making a monster. <sighs> I need help. I've gotta find my key before. Before Slab opens up the biology lab, steals all of their dissection frogs, and sets them loose in the girls' bathroom. Hey, Ivy. Hutch! Hi! What, what was that? Oh, that was just me belching. I have a huge gas problem. So, you busy after school? Baseball practice. Yeah, coach wants me to work on catching flies. <laughs> okay. We're gonna have to search Slab's locker for the key. It's locked, but we tried. <laughs> Don't worry. This electromagnet should gain us access by slowly drawing the hinges out of the locker door. Okay. Fire her up. Whoa. Turn it off! Turn it off! 
thing that worked. <laughs> Ew, gross. Said the man who has a severed foot in his lunch bag. That's for science. We're making... We're not making a monster! <laughs> Ballet slippers? You don't think Slab ate a ballerina? What do you think you're doing? I know the drill. <laughs> you do ballet? Of course not. It's like the reason I'm angry all the time is because my portly stature means I'll never be the prince in Swan Lake. <laughs> Look, Slab, could I please just have my key back? Sure. Really? Yeah, after school. But you're gonna have to rip it out of my cold, dead hands. <laughs> Except my hands will be alive still. And yours are gonna be cold and dead. Because I'm gonna make you not alive anymore. And it's cold out. Wordy, but I get the point. Great. What else is this day gonna throw at me? Oh, no, I can't turn it off! Somebody please help! What's happening? Ah! This is so cool. It's just like the trash compactor scene from Star Wars. What am I gonna do? If I tell Tater I'm missing my key, I'll lose my job. And if I try to get it back from Slab, I'll lose my life! Quite the conundrum. Where do you keep the butter? Maybe I should grow a mustache, change my name to Pepe, and move to Guatemala. Can you even grow a mustache? I mean, feel this thing. It's so smooth. Smooth like jazz. I like that nickname for you. Jazz. I'm gonna call you Jazz. Will you focus? I'm in big trouble. All right. All right, chill out. I got your back, Jazz. I've called someone who can help. Day. Hello. Ah! I understand you would like to be trained in the art of self-defense. Look, Ben, I appreciate the offer, but there's no point. Slab is twice my size. Butterfly can kill man if land in right place. No, that's stupid. Butterfly very tiny and weak. But you can bring down any foe with pressure point. Yo, the monkey poop. Cool. Then, while enemy is dazed, leap on back and pour out hair like rice harvest. Zow, yow, yow. Nice. And finally, by going in under stern, you can tear out man's heart and let him watch its final beat. What? <laughs> I don't need to show you. It's pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Young. Mom, what are you doing here? The school called me. Ivy's in the nurse's office. Is she all right? Does she need mouth to mouth? <laughs> I'm sure she's fine. They just said she had a little frog in her throat. Uh, <laughs> well, I should probably go check on Ivy. Wait, Mom, I've been thinking. You know how you were kind of bummed when I didn't take that job at NASA? No, I get it. You want the high school experience you never had. Hanging out with friends, kissing a girl. Getting beat up by a bully. Exactly. <laughs> I'm proud of you. I know how scary high school can be when you're cool and popular. I can only imagine what it's like for you. <laughs> Echo, please, when we're not in class, you can call me Adam. Okay. Adam, are you crazy? You need to get out of here. I can't run away. I'm a teacher. You're a kid. I'm both. There he is. You showed up. Guess you're not so much of a genius after all. <laughs> Uh, come on, Slap. Look how cloudy it is. 
How about a rain delay? <laughs> you like rain? Sailor to thunder and umbrella Fitzgerald. No! Oh. Oh. Come on, don't give up! Oh, thanks, Ivy. That means a lot. I was talking to Slab. Oh. Oh. All right, you've left me no choice. Pressure point. Hey ya! Hey ya! Hey ya! Hey ya! Hey ya! Any last words? Yes. Now! <laughs> what is this? String? Not just any string, kite string. <laughs> now, I think you're gonna wanna hand over my key. <laughs> you mean this key? Now, why would I wanna do that? Ask Benjamin Franklin. Or next time, just pay attention to my class. Ow, oh, hot key, hot key! Don't hurt me, you powerful wizard! <laughs> Mr. Adam, you were incredible. You know, I wondered how Ben Franklin's kite string was able to conduct electricity. Now I realize it's not the string, it's the rainwater. That's right, you're right, I love you. What? Uh, I, I love that you knew that. <laughs> Science rocks. <laughs> High five. Ah, Mr. Young. I see you have your key after all. Of course I do. I may be a 14-year-old teacher, but... You have nothing to worry about. Help! Run for your lives! Oh. Oh. Derby, you made a monster? Monster? That's my Nana. She's mad I stole her foot. Oh. Oh.